a special toast to a fallen hero. We found out today there's a special beer in the making that will be brewed to honor Comstock Fire Chief Ed Switalski. The chief was killed in the line of duty last month. Brady Gillum broke the news of this new honor earlier today and has the details all new at 7. It's in the small brewery behind me that firefighters came up with a big idea. Did you come here with Ed and, and drink some beers? Yes, quite a lot, quite often. From a tragedy comes a silver lining. It was, it was a great man, and the, the firemen that are here uh, are good friends. Comstock Fire Chief Ed Switalski was killed last month in the line of duty. Last night, the firefighters he left behind decided to honor him with a special brew. Any one particular memory that stands out here with Ed or... Not that I should share in the news. <laughs> <laughs> it's something they hope will keep his memory alive. When the chief came here from Illinois, he wasn't much of a, uh, he didn't enjoy beer. He wasn't used to it. So obviously it's Kalamazoo and we have the best breweries in the state. So we, uh, we taught him how to enjoy beer. And this is where it started at. Officer Eric Zapata, employee number 11611 is off duty for the final time. Boatyard Brewing has done this before when it created Easy Ale to honor fallen Kalamazoo Department of Public Safety Officer Eric Zapata. So it sounds like uh, uh, there's another opportunity, yes. unfortunately. Unfortunately, yes, yeah, sadly. Thompson and Steele say the chief special beer will be a red ale. I loved it, so we're gonna kind of stick with that. It's a great drinking, uh, British style beer. Beyond that, they won't release many details like what they'll call Spitalski's beer. I think we got one good name, but it's one that they're gonna have to agree on. Although the beer is a nice gesture, both men agree they'd rather share a beer with Ed than make one in his honor. It's tough, but I think being around the good friends here helps and, and that's that's why we keep coming back. That's what I would do. There's no date yet as to when the beer will be released. We'll keep in touch with the firefighters and let you know when that happens. In Kalamazoo, Brady Gillum, 24-Hour News 8.